So the last time we saw the iPhone and the Galaxy in a speed test, there was zero separation between the two, with the phones coming within milliseconds of each other. But today, Samsung is looking to finally pull ahead, with the S25 Ultra not only being powered by an overclocked version of the Snapdragon 8 Elite chip, but it also features a 40% larger cooling system while running on Android 15 with One UI 7. The iPhone, on the other hand, has had months and months to optimize its software, with it running on the latest version of iOS 18. And you know, that A18 Pro chip is still one of the most powerful mobile chips out there. Will that be enough to keep the Galaxy from running away with it? Or will Android's most popular flagship set a new bar? Let's find out. All right, we'll kick things off by starting the stopwatches on each phone and then jumping into the first row, where there wasn't really a difference in Facebook, but in Starbucks, the Galaxy was able to get the small step, and it seems to have pulled further ahead in Microsoft Word. So a good start from the Galaxy early on, with it maintaining its lead through Excel. Last year with the S24 Ultra, the two phones were neck and neck at this point, but this time the S25 Ultra is just ripping through things, as both phones start working on Snapseed, where they're editing the same photo, applying the same filter, and then exporting the final image out to storage, where it looks like the Galaxy is doing it at a significantly faster rate. So not the best start for the iPhone in this speed test, with it still on that last step in Snapseed, as the Galaxy is already getting started with the video export in LumaFusion. Now, something worth noting really quick is we did have to program in a delay on the iPhone to make up for the extra steps that the Android version of LumaFusion requires, so that way everything is still nice and fair, where from the looks of it, the Galaxy is just flying through it, processing this clip roughly 25% faster than the iPhone, which is a pretty big deal since this is the area where the iPhone typically made its comeback. But clearly not this time, with the Galaxy already moving on to the gaming row as the iPhone is still chugging along, with it taking a full 6 seconds longer to complete the task. Of course, the good news for the iPhone is the gaming row is an area that historically it's dominated in. So as it starts working on Subway Surfers, we'll see if it could cut down on the Galaxy lead. But unfortunately, it was slightly slower in Subway Surfers, as it is here in Flip Diving, with the Galaxy having either been tied or faster in every single app so far. However, in Going Balls, the iPhone finally breaks that streak, loading the game at a faster rate, with it looking to do the same in Forward Assault. But you know, it's just too little too late, with the Galaxy already working on the bottom row and showing absolutely no signs of slowing down. So for the iPhone, now it's just about not falling any further behind, as this is probably going to be the most the iPhone has lost by in years, with the Galaxy completing the first lap with a time of 2 minutes and 18 seconds, as the iPhone only gets bogged down in Disney+. Plus. So wow, this is going to be a huge difference, with the iPhone finally completing the first lap a whopping 15 seconds later. Now, obviously, both of these phones are fast, right? Like, unless you put them side by side like this, you probably wouldn't notice much of a difference. But at the same time, you have to give credit where credit is due, with the Galaxy S25 Ultra and that Snapdragon 8 Elite chip being the real deal. Now, with plenty of RAM, we'll go ahead and fast forward the phones to the finish line, where due to having a few less double swipes, the iPhone is able to knock off a second from its total time. But still, the end result is the same, with the winner by a huge margin being the Galaxy Galaxy S25 Ultra. Anyways, that is it for me in this video. Thank you for watching, and as always, I'll see you in the very next episode.